So how will you kill Steiner? Lady Nightingale. I told you to stop calling me that. The name gives the survivors hope, Polina. Hope would win this war. Боже мой. Да. To followers of Lady Nightingale. Anyone who gives asylum to this terrorist will face the most severe penalties. So, yeah. Let's go up this way. Do you think the sniper could be one of Steiner's Jaeger models? We should be more careful. Nina. Do you hear that? Take a look. There, on the right. Steiner. Where is he going? He's driving towards the commercial district. You may be right about those Jaeger mortars, Misha. Let's move before we lose sight of him. Misha, be careful! with my knife! Do what? Trust me! Drink fire! That's me done, yeah. Ready to shoot! I've got your back! Took them out! Let's go!
Only room for one sniper in Stalingrad. Dead? I think so. Much better than I thought. Oh, you didn't have to fight him. Let's get out of this field. Well, we should be safe for now. Two Jaeger mortars. You must have them worried. It means we're getting close. Let's keep moving then. Look, Steiner's vehicle. I can't shoot him while he's in there. Let's try to get closer. I can't wait to put a bullet through Steiner's head. Wait. This is bad, Polina. We can't strike from here. There's too many of them. Take a look. Shit. Steiner. There, on the right. Bastard. He might be Steiner's superior. Sniper, get down! <laughs> ah! <sighs> 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 Are you okay? Misha! Uh, it's not as bad as it looks. Just hold still and let me check. Uh, that doesn't sound good. It's not. We don't have time for this, Sister Oka. You hear me? I need to get you somewhere safe to patch you up. You're not going to die here. Stop! Let's move! I'm getting you to the post office. We'll be safe there. Steady your breathing! Life isn't it's going to get us out of here. Look, we need to finish. Please, for all of us. No, you're delirious. Come on, we have to move. Malina, go! No! You cover the opening. I go out and flank them. There is no I'm time. Go. Oh. I will slow them down. Oh, it's all right.
I know you are Steiner. here somewhere. Bastard. You will not get away this time, little bird. Sie kann nirgendwohin weiter suchen. Then you, girl, you are all alone in here. Bastard. Gewachsen. Ist das der beste Nazi? 
fancy fucks have to offer? Bleiben Sie wachsam! Dama Nachtigall ist hier irgendwo drin. Troops gone, and you're next. Without your rifle, Lady Nightingale, you are exactly where I want you. 
Best of all, but you have not faced me yet. I know all about you, Paulina. Paul, there you are. But you have not faced me yet. I know. <laughs> Russian bitch! To nurse back! Shade! Nazis will all die here in Stalingrad. You took everything from me. Now it's my turn. <coughs> you won't find satisfaction in this. It won't end with me. We'll destroy you all. You won't be doing anything. Not me. Yeah. It's your turn! Fascista! Spinia! All you've left me is this night. You're all the same. 
They've killed more of you than I can count. And you all spout the same pathetic bullshit. Rising. Is he supposed to scare me? Another piece of fascist filth. Don't worry. I'll hunt him down next. You thought you'd take my city and crush my people. You tried to break me, but you failed. You created Lady Nightingale. And now, she's destroyed you. <coughs> Infamous Lady Nightingale brought Stalingrad back from the brink. Her actions inspired the Russians to take back their city and go on the offensive. Polina changed the course of the war for the Allies and her people. With that reputation, it was only a matter of time before we found her. What would Freisinger want with a lowly officer on the Eastern Front? What does it matter? It matters a great deal to me, Fraulein. Freisinger was recruiting Steiner for some special project. Project Phoenix. Could be. All I know is... I was sent to kill Freisinger. Gotta be a better way out of here. There is no way out of here. Unless, of course, you have decided to do the intelligent thing. Open that door back up, and I'll show you the intelligent thing. You can get me out alive? What? I can. <laughs> you two faced bastard. All right. I'll tell you what you want to know. Typical Aussie. No honor, no loyalty. Break this up. I can't. I ain't gonna be the next sacrifice in your crusade, Tommy. I hope your plan was worth it. Break a leg, Lucas. I thought you'd be the one to put an end to your team's foolish agenda. You killing each other now, are you? So look, so look. I know why you chose to cooperate. 
I would not take orders from a Negro either. <laughs> you got it all wrong, mate. Then unfollow. I don't care what colour his skin is. Haven't you heard about the Aussies and the Brits? We were the pieces of shit flushed down the crown's dunny. Yes, yes, of course, but your nations are allies. It was more like master servant. I did what I did because to every Brit, folks like me are expendable. Insubordinate, churlish, no stranger to a prison cell. That's Lucas. You had to credit the SOE. They were very good at spotting talent in the unlikeliest of places. And Lucas had talent. He was a skilled demolitionist with an explosive temperament and a sharp tongue. Out there in the desert, the rats of Tobruk were like a family. Unfortunately, they never did figure out how to get along with the brass. Today, princess. I'm savoring the moment. Oh, I'm so sorry. Of course you are, your highness. Hey, Bluey, wake up. You're gonna want to see this one. Oh, fuck me. Play the damn cards. <laughs> All right, Des. Read them and weep. Oh, you fucking donkey. No way. Why the bloody hell aren't you at your post? Uh, Major Hems, we thought... We thought you'd muck around. Major, convoy's approaching. Right. You rats, follow me. I'll try and act like real soldiers for once. Sir. Oh, uh, yes, sir. No, sir. Three. See, that's what a real soldier looks like, mate. <laughs> oh, what a way to stand up to him, Bluey. Good job, buddy. Fuck off, Des. What's he even doing here in the first place, huh? He's a major. He can do whatever he wants. You're lucky. I was about to make me come back. Shut up, Des. You've never beat me at anything. What? Ah, oh, mate, pull the other one. The explosives are ready. Lucas and I set them ourselves. Sir? Man your position. The timing must be perfect. I need you all to focus. You got eyes on them? We have to call the pad. Hang on now, what's that in the lead? I said, be quiet. I suppose I'll do the honors then. That's a tank. I know. No, but the armor's too thick. We didn't pack it for a tank. Bloody hell. It's okay, we hit the treads. That's the only way to stop it. I need to focus. Wait for the treads though, yeah? Wait, 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 no, 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 wait! Oh, you distracted me. Have they seen us yet? They think it's a mine. Quiet, everyone. Stay quiet. Lucas! Bet you could throw a banger into that tank's hatch. Stay low!
just normal now. Run out. Clear these trucks. <laughs> Let's on him. Lucas, search that one on the end. Raid and half the supplies we wanted have gone up in smoke. Sir, there's still one truck down the ridge. Well, then take some rats and get after them, Jacobs. Let's go. No good for sniffing around the dirt. And when you're done, walk your Are you serious? That'll take all fucking night. Let's go, Brabus. Told you they didn't get far. Watch out, one's still alive. We can fix that. <sighs> Good night, Kraut. Thought there were more. One dead in the truck. Other wanker must have run off. Then we find it. Yeah, that's more rifle than you can handle. Bigger the better, mate. <sighs> Fresh blood. Follow it. Fucking genius idea, Jacobs. That's Sir to you, Private. The name's Des, and that's Lucas, and neither of us give a fuck about your rank. We all know about you, Jacobs. Us rats pay attention. Quiet. Do you hear that? Who's he shouting to? This way. For this, we can take him. Are you mad? You got me and Lucas. Keep down. Don't let me see. see. There's that undershirt. Here we go. Stop. Then we're leaving. Hey, I found something. You read Crow? A little. Of course he does. It looks like one of Rommel's officers checked through here to visit a camp up the way. I don't know what kind. I don't recognize these symbols. Then we go take a look. The Krauts just lit up the sky. More could be coming. No, we return to base. Report to the Major. We can't report a thing if we don't know what it is. That wouldn't be good soldiering, Jacobs. Fine. We'll scope it out. 
Let's tread quietly this time. Lucas, coming or what? This road should take us directly to the camp. Yeah, straight into those cracks. Get off the road before they see us. Into the ruins. I told you they saw the flare. That glow on the horizon. It must be the German camp. I say we stay off the road, or we cut through the desert. Quickly! Do not engage. Every crowd of their mind is out looking for us.
sure you're going the right way. I'm going the only way, you dickhead. That's enough, Des. This isn't a joke. I need a drink. Talk with your man, Hans. He's got plenty. What? He's never shared a sip from his fancy flask? <laughs> well, there should be plenty to go around. He's a bloody lightweight. If I ever get my hands on that wanker's flask, mm -hmm. it's my shout, fellas. Hang on. There's a light up ahead. Looks like we found the German camp. Where is everybody? Probably out looking for us, I reckon. <laughs> Look at this. I think the chap on the left is wrong. Who's the fancy bugger? Seriously? We're gathering intelligence. Something you obviously lack, Private. Hilarious. You sort your papers. You know what I see? I see a ton of shit outside that goes boom. Now, what do you suppose we should do about that? Uh, well, we should blow it the fuck up. <laughs> That's what I call target rich. <laughs> Motor pool on the left. Ammo dump just ahead. Gas depot on the right, just asking to be lit up. Ammo dump just ahead. Gas depot on the right, just asking to be lit up.
That was glorious, Lucas! Wait, did you guys hear that? Australian private and a group of rats had given Rommel a huge black eye. Their action should have earned them medals and maybe even a shred of respect. Hams didn't see it that way. Their reward was some time in the brig. However, all Richter seemed to care about was Rommel and his connection to Freisinger. That fool would listen to Lucas as long as we needed him to. did Freisinger want with Rommel? I thought you wanted to know about our team. Answer me now or our deal is off. Okay, okay. Don't get your undies in a twist. Lucas piled it on like a chap. He didn't have to tell Richter anything more than the lies that Nazi already told himself. That was the Third Reich for you. Their reality was delusion. You'd think we'd need a miracle for Lucas to pull this off. The thing is, he was like a magnet for that kind of luck. There's that saying about lightning striking twice, yet Lucas had managed to find himself first at Tobruk and then at El Alamein. The world knew of an Allied victory in North Africa. 
But it wasn't because of British commanders or mighty tanks. Lucas had the untold story, and Richter was eating it up. Got himself a big snippy today. He must smell a promotion. After the intel that we dropped on that wank, this is the plan that he comes up with. Buckley's chance is gonna work. What's he saying, Jacobs? Oh, he's personally thanking you and Des for being stand-up chaps. It's stuffed. It's king and country. It's always king and country. <sighs> Bloody hell, is that what I think it is? Where'd you swipe that from? Found it lying around. If he catches you with that, you're a dead man. I'll drink to that. Bloody hell! Die. Stop talking! And she around! Return fire!
squeeze through here, I think. Lucas, give me a hand. Jacobs, go! Des! Oi! Look at that mess! Hams calls that an advance? German infantry are swarming our tanks! Well then let's mess with their infantry! Oh yeah, we'll just waltz our way through a field of death! Well, we're not here to fuck spiders! Okay. The Major, we're being torn apart! I gave you an order! Form the perimeter! Protect the armor! Sir, you gotta be bloody joking! We will hold this line! Our air support is fucked! If we don't deal with those flat cannons, there's not gonna be a fucking line! You have your orders! Bugger the orders! We are 
I taking that hill? Alone? Nah. I got me, and I got Jess. Fucking oath. Here, take this. You clear those flat cannons, shoot this flare nice and high, then I know to radio our bombers. Good luck. Let's go. Oh, I'm taking some blue we can hold out. Are this way. Imagine the look on Ham's face when we pull this off. You joking? You just say it was all his idea. Look at him. Shit, that was close. Sneaky bastard, check your corner. Until the bombers arrive. Help me with this MG. Uh, 
There. Dance by the flare. I didn't expect today to end like this. Ah, fuck it, why not? Let's do this! As usual, I'll do all the work. Yeah, we're going out. Let's take as many of these bastards with us as we can. We ain't done here! Where are those bombers? They better hurry up, cause I'm winning! You're not winning! I am winning! And you'd better catch up! Lucas! Half-tracks coming in on the right! I see them! Sometimes, the only way to honor a fallen soldier is to finish the mission. But try remembering that while their blood stains your boots. That's what I told Lucas when we first met. 
War had taught us both that lesson. The rigid hierarchy of Allied command would look at Lucas and see only character flaws. Insubordinate, churlish, no stranger to a prison cell. He was perfect for my team. Even if he does have a mean right hook. Lucas played his role perfectly. He had Richter distracted and doubting everything he thought he knew. Are you all right, mate? You, you're looking a little bit pastier than usual. Piss. This was... This was... Never about winning the war. This was never about winning the war. This... was a coup. This was a coup. Temple of... That's how he's getting them out. Taking the Reich underground. Wait a minute. You're not part of the plan, are you? Well, it looks like we're both going to end up on that meat pile back there. One thing I learned studying Allied strategy. Redundancy. Always have a plan B. With the Soviets invading the city, Lady Nightingale will be my leverage. I will exchange her for my own safe passage. Well, that's one hell of a plan, Fritz. It probably would have worked. Let you go. <laughs> you made one mistake, but it was a bloody ripper. <laughs> you thought you cracked us. Redundancy, mate. Always have a plan B. I've just received word. We have safe passage from Berlin. Three years. We have waited for this moment. Many good men were lost. Rommel, Steiner, Itzel. But I promised you, Project Phoenix would succeed. Hitler has paid for his weakness. And now history will remember him as we do. A failure! The Red Army is nearly upon us. <laughs> and Berlin is burning. But from the ashes shall rise our vision for something greater. To the Fourth Reich. <laughs>
That's where Richard. Transport be home in time for supper. Or we can end this. Hunt down Freisinger, bury the Reich for good. We might not make it out of Berlin, but neither will the Nazis. Whatever we do, though, we do it together. Freisinger is not leaving for the left. Surprise me, Lamingtons can wait. Wait? Hey, it's not every day you get a chance to kill a Fuhrer. You can't turn that shit down, right? <laughs> After you, Lady Nightingale. Just so you know, I still haven't ruled out killing you all. <laughs> <laughs> 